So let's say, for example, you have a garden hose in a swimming pool, filling up the water. Right, and the hose is actually in the swimming pool. Swimming pool. I didn't say like hanging over the edge of the swimming pool. I said inside the swimming pool, submerged in water. All of a sudden, you now you have a water main break or some other disruption of the water supply. That's a constant pressure. And let's say instead of it being sixty psi, now it's nothing. You're gonna have back siphonage, and that swimming pool water filled with kids pishy and other diseases in unsanitary pools. I know your pool is sanitized. I'm saying hypothetically. You're going to have now swimming pool water filled with cocky and other nasty stuff and chemicals in the public water supply. That's one example. Another example is a standing pool of water in a irrigation field and, you know, a sprinkle ahead is in the middle of it. And it's just poor draining field. Same principle. You lose water pressure at the source, you're going to suck in that pool of water into the public water supply. You know, they have fertilizer and chemicals. 